What's going on, everybody? It's your boy John for the Game Do here. Welcome to you back to another episode of the Saga Lock. Moving my microphone a little bit because, well, you know, um, it's called Quiet Day today. Um, because I'm recording at one in the morning. Yeah, so we're kings. Um, also, whatever, it's fine. Today, we get some encounters. Hopefully they're good. Um, they probably won't be because it's me. But, you know, one can dream, right? I mean, we already are. Like, look, let's be honest. I get to actually look at the screen today because I decided to change the way that the layout was a little bit. Oh, well, one, let me get rid of the red because I hate the red. The red makes me mad. But, yeah, I got to change the screen a little bit. The other thing that I thought about, too, as I'm looking at that, you know, bottom left corner of the screen is I lately have been kind of doing hilarious things where it's just like, what the hell is going on and why are you doing it? Kind of mo- Oh, I will take that fairy type move and uh, that, is that the first fairy type move we have? Sorry, I am extremely distracted. I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna have to go back to the normal layout because I'm way too distracted. This is too much, too much serotonin. Um. This is where I gotta look. Okay, Dazzling Gleam. It is our first fairy type move. But the only one that could realistically utilize learning it is Satan. Um, and honestly, I am going to get rid of... I'm gonna get rid of Diamond Storm. I like Diamond Storm, but having a fairy type move is so beneficial that I can't, get, I can't say no. Because that is our, like I said, our only fair type move. Also, this is totally an encounter, and I was like, let's go figure it out. What are we going to get? Did we even buy the Pokeballs that I said I was going to buy? Probably not. Hey, Alamola. It's a heart Pokemon. The best Pokemon to have when we're talking about the guy from the bottom of the layout. 100%. But yeah, we'll hit use non-stab Dazzling Gleam, and honestly, this should live. You know, unless Satan crits, but you know, it's fine. Travis Kelsey just wants me by for himself and he's not engaged or married or he's literally single. So like, yes, at least that's a better than what I was before. Honestly, that is way better than what it was before. Just like you're married, don't care. Now it's you're single, it makes sense. And I feel better about crushing hard. Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. Does it? Does it? The stupid questions, but does it make you guys feel better too? Like, it makes me feel better when I'm like, okay, okay, you're fine. You're not. You don't have a significant other. I'm not being a home wrecker or anything. Definitely, definitely a win in my books. But I don't know. Let me know. Oh, a dream ball. Nice. Mola <laughs> dream ball. Hot man on the left. It's this is just first week of the month, guys. Just let me have it, okay? Okay, it's not really first week of the month, but it feels like it because January's gonna suck, y'all. It's gonna be bad. I am not ready. Oh, that this, oh that's right because the beach the beach doesn't exist. It's going to be rough because okay, so technically, okay, so first week of the month is of course January first, which just means fantastic. Happilessness, honestly, because yeah, that's a full week. Um, I mean, it's a full week every time, but like, it's definitely oh, it's like a 70 mile an hour winds coming at you live at, from freaking this episode. So, another shiny. That's not a shiny, but we're leading with our good Pokemon. We're leading with the Pokemon we want to lead here, but yeah, it's actually kind of insane when you think about it. It's like, what the heck, brain? Like, this is the amalgamation. Like, this is the stuff that my brain decided to come up with. Like, and this, it's just, it's just great. It's lovely. It's lovely when your brain just like, yeah, this is what you're doing. This is gonna be the theme. Oh, it's. Why is that actually perfectly lined up with Jaded Penguin's portrait? <laughs> oh my god. 
Jellybird wants to has a hold of a of your bag and won't let go. I mean, you can have a you can have a hold of my bag. That's fine. Uh, we want to go to the berry fields. Ugh, going to the berry fields. I don't know if this is something for the public. But okay, fine. We'll go pick berries at the berry fields. Oh, more team skull. I forgot. Team skull kind of just exists literally everywhere. I'm so mad that I didn't catch the love Pokemon. Like, we literally had a possibility of catching the love heart Pokemon. And freaking Satan wants to crit it? Come on, Travis. Travis. You're not supposed to be doing that. You're only supposed to be critical hitting um, the football players. No, Effie in particular. You're, that's not allowed. Absolutely not allowed. Why do you have Primordial Seed? Yeah, that's the mo Effie in particular is completely describing what this first week of the month is going to be. So, you know what? At least he's telling the truth. It's literally going to be a monsoon. So, good luck, guys. Have fun. This is just the preface of first week of the month. And we're already here. So, I'm not even going to, like... I'm not even... You guys, just don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's oh, first week of the month is only two days away. It's fine. Actually, for you guys, it's tomorrow. It's fine. It's fine. It's okay. It's just fine. I'm definitely 100% not brain dead. It's it's just it's it's good. <sighs> that Gyarados has some great skills. I know. It's a big, long, lovely Gyarados. That's what it is. Okay. It's Travis Kelsey. That's why. That's why it performs so well on the football field. And not anywhere else. Because it's the football field. And the football field is honestly what where, where Travis Kelsey dominates. Let's be fair. Football. We stand it. Um, I'm actually... Oh, no, I'm not. I'm actually wearing the thing I'm not actually wearing. I was thinking it was... What the... F another shiny... All the shinies, they're, they're just as slick as these guys' hair. It's like, wow, okay, hi. Um, hmm. I actually don't necessarily know how to deal with this. I'm going to go with Travis Kelsey, a.k.a. Satan, and hopefully that works right and does what it needs to do. Oh, I don't like that. Not a good start. Oh, that's the thing we never went. We, we you need to remember to actually go buy the freaking thing for Satan. Because I forgot to do that. Now, beautifully... It's not like there's a big problem with that, but hey, we're doing our first trial. That extra damage could be um, very utilizable. Yay is level 15. Balboa is level 15. You know what? With that damage actually having, having a chance to come in super handy, I'm going to make sure we buy it now before I'm like, oh, what is that again? What is that thing I'm supposed to be buying? Like... Because, look, I know myself well enough to know that I'm going to forget. And now that I'm bringing it up because I'm staring at the beard of Travis Kelsey, it's fine. Honestly, though, nothing beats Shady's. Let's be fair. I, I have to say it out loud. Nothing beats that. But. Oh, I can't get in. Of course. Oh, yeah, that's right. There's no, no crazy first week of the month boys allowed. Got it. Okay, so we're back where we started, and we didn't get the orb. You want to know why? Because apparently you have to beat Hala in order to access the freaking mall. Yep, so this that's the most dead mall ever, because you have to beat... You have to beat the literal Kahuna in order to even access the dang mall in the first place. It's like, how many people actually beat the Kahuna? Not very many, so like the fact that you have to beat him 
in order to even access this dang mall. Like, what the hell? Okay, like, okay, I'm like, I'm not super Omega complaining, but I mean, I am a little bit because there's something super important that I was literally saving my money for that I can't even go get because it's like, oh, by the way, you have not beaten the Kahuna yet. It's like, but, so I went to the right place first, and so, but I went searching around, wasted all your guys' extra time, which is actually funny that I went to the right place first because usually I don't do that. Oh boy. Well then, that's something. We're definitely putting that on magic, because he's got the magic in me. But yeah, um, to be fair though, we should put that on Satan, because it's Travis Kelsey, and Travis Kelsey probably is going to get a lucky egg. But, you know, he has at least one half of the equation. Oh, uh, we're talking about this. You know what? I, I can continue talking about Travis Kelsey. I don't really care about this whole PMC. Oh my god, you gotta call it by the acronym because we're hip. It's like, no. No. Let's not. Oh, let me also give you pointless items because we're hip. How? Stop. Stop being a menace to society. Nobody deserves that. Nobody deserves you up. Because you're actually pretty bad. Um, okay, how much money do we even have? Did we actually save a lot of money? I probably feel like we did. Yeah, we did because we're us. Well, first off, let's get 10 Super Potions, just in case the game decides to hate us. Heal Ball likes us in a series that you guys don't get to see for a while, but so let's buy like 15 of them, just in case. I actually remember in, uh, it would have been, not Cage Lock, Trilink, where I actually caught a Legendary in a Heal Ball. That was really fun. That was before people, like, or before we figured out that, oh, you can actually randomize items. Did you know that? Like, randomizing items, that's a thing. So it's very funny now, because we just picked up a random lucky, like, like, I feel like that's how I'm going to... What? Did we get super lucky, or are these berry items also random? And we just go. <laughs> oh my gosh. Now I really wish I had a Lola Mola. My golly gee, Whitaker's Batman. Imagine if we actually caught the fish of love. I forgot Travis Kelsey had a Rena Trap. He can Rena Trap all he wants. Um. Uh oh. Okay, at least I was right. Uh. Now we have more defensive Travis Kelsey. Travis did not like the fact that, you know, he could eat his leftovers. Apparently, he has an expensive taste. Um, well, crap, Travis. Why'd you do that? I wanted, I liked you having arena trap. That actually was very beneficial, my dude. <laughs> but okay. I guess we can't have arena trap. We can't arena trap m anymore. It's like, gosh dang it, Travis. I'll just trap you on the bed instead. It's fine. Um, if that's what you really want. But I, I guess. I guess, you know. I don't care that you want a quick king size bed. I like cuddles. So extra long twin it is. Honestly, though, I feel like technically speaking, if I have two people on the bed, it would probably be a queen size just for their comfort. But like... I don't mind cuddling, so like an extra long twin would be just fine. Squish me in the corner, I don't care. <laughs> like honestly, I, I will sleep in the corner. I don't I mean I do it anyway, and I'm one person on a bed. So like you can have like 80% of the bed, I can have 20% of the bed. It's fine. I am like the best sleep partner ever. I mean, other than the fact that I move, but 
It's fine. It's a sign of appreciation. Just deal with it. Um, no, I do. I move in my sleep. So, like, that's why I, a lot of the times you'll see, like, in the background, my bed's, like, not made at all. It's because I move all, like, and so it's, like, I'm not going to do it. Either. Like, I'm too lazy to do that. Now, should I be less lazy? Yes, 100%. Like, I need to get better about it. But still, in my head, I'm just, like, what's the point in even doing it? If I'm going to move and literally wreck it like this. Like, this is not, like, it's not usually that tsunami-like, but... It's there's usually it's pretty bad. So then it's like I just figure it out. But it is nice to get into the bed when it's like when it is made. So yeah, I'm gonna try and make an effort to make it a little bit more. But <sighs> one thing I do know is that uh, yeah, like I literally was like, you, like I'll sleep m lately on this the new extension because we got I, my I actually my family was amazing and my like Christmas present was a foam topper like a four inch foam topper and I was like that was amazing because I wasn't expecting it at all like I was like oh okay that's that's up anyway so I've been sleeping more on this side for some reason and I'm like no get back to the wall shove me against the wall I need I need a force to shove me against the wall again okay I actually like that spot in the bed so bring me back to life okay and that would be the best way to be brought back to life <laughs> literally like let, nobody's gonna you can't contend with it speaking of not being able to contend, holy hell okay so I was playing Elden Ring because um, I downloaded it duh that's how you play it you have to download it first uh, but I I don't know how I feel about it yet so I'm not gonna make my complete analysis of the game um, but what I do know is that it's more open world, which I already am not an open world fan to begin with. So that's already a knock um, on the game right there. Like, th I know that's quick and all, but again, I'm not an open world person. I like linearity. Why do you think I played Pokemon? Why do you think I have enjoyed Persona as much as I have? It's because it's got the open world aspect. In Persona, it's a little bit more open, and I even talk about need it needing more direction sometimes, where I'm looks like I want to know what I need to accomplish. I want to know what I can do to do to be better, or how I can be better. Other than just huh, get good. Um, so I don't know. So, anyways, um, I tailspin. Oh, um, so in Elden Ring. There's a setting for Travis Kelsey. And I was like, oh, can I make it like Travis Kelsey? No, it's literally like a grazing. And I was like, excuse me, you cannot say, oh, hi, item I missed. You cannot say you have a body hair function and that your max body hair function is m maybe, maybe what TJ Watt would have if like you have just a grazing okay that is not max okay we want Travis Kelsey levels not oh, shady penguin levels too though perfectly fine don't those are just fine no no we are not gonna have like if I'm having max I want Yeti okay no <laughs> I'm sorry that is not Max. I got so triggered. Uh, my friends, were, I was talking about it with my friends a little bit, and my friends were like, why are you so triggered by this? I was like, because I'm a fanatic, okay? And if I'm a fanatic, it means that I really, really want it. And no, no, we're not gonna get it. And it's like, it's promising me something. It's not delivering upon it, okay? Like, tangle me up in it, that's fine too. But like, obviously that's unrealistic and that's different, but realism is important and if I have max it has to be Travis Kel like I would have accepted Travis Kelsey levels because that makes sense okay that's like that makes a lot of sense but no we're gonna give me like maybe Kirk Cousins on it like if he didn't shave it like on like anyways I'm I'm tail spinning but it's fine I'm just I was tr very triggered by that stopping catch him ooh that is better than bulldoze in my opinion. Oh, 
Is the previous movie? No, 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 no. Um, I remember now. I was like, oh my god, we have Fissure. That will work for that. No, it does not. But... I'm gonna get rid of. I'm gonna get rid of Swift. No, I'm. Yes, I am. It's this. Yes, I am. As much as the joy move, I have to on the front of. I have half as much special attack than I have attack. Otherwise, it would be a lot different of a story, and I probably would keep it because Swift is a nice double battle move. Which, but in this game, for as much pairing as you have what's I give these team skulls pairing we're gonna pair we're gonna fight you really only have one true section where it's double battle and that's we're literally called the hell section because it's difficult and one of the few difficult sections of this game but scram it's gonna be a petrat or something no. Oh, okay, so the outside does not count towards the inside. Okay, good to know. The outside does not, not, it does not like, co co correspond with, yes, that's the word. It does not correspond with each other in that way. So good to know. I really hope EA evolves, but I don't think EA will. Oh, never mind. I lied. Yay and Bumbo are both level 16. Big W. Come on, Yay. Come on, Miss Yay. You can do it. Also, love how I never change the genders. I was like, oh, don't worry, guys. I'll remember to change the genders. <laughs> nope. Remember when I said that and also said, oh, I probably won't remember, but it's fine. <laughs> both statements were true. You defeated all the Pokemon. You can now take on the trial. Cool. Well, first off, let's see what Ye has as an ability. Ye ha. Shady might stay on the layout. I'm sorry. Shady might stay on the layout because I cannot stand to fathom or look at Ye right now for having true on. You want to explain yourself, Yay? Because you really need to explain yourself. You don't even get a slot. You know what? No, you don't. You don't. You don't get a choice. I don't care that it's first week of the month. You are, and I'm mad, and I'm probably doing this emotionally to attack you, Yay. But I would much rather stare at Shady than stare at you, and that's gonna be happening. All the other men, unfortunately, will be off the layout. But Shady Penguin gets to stay on the layout because it, it, you're trash, Yay. You are going to, and you better freaking get a better ability when you get the Moonstone, whenever we get that, however we get that. But gosh dang it, Yay. You got my hopes up for nothing, girl. I'm pissed at you right now, Yay. You deserve being pissed at. Like I said, Shady staying on the layout. I'm sorry for all the other men that feel disrespected by the fact that Shady Penguin gets to stay on the layout and nobody else. I would keep Travis Kelsey on the layout too. I mean, I'd keep all these men on the layout, but again, I'm getting too distracted um, by having all five of them, so I needed to trim down anyway. Um, and let's be honest, if I was gonna trim down, I would have had to take all of them all out to be fair, and being fair is easy. And But then, you know, Yay needed some redeemable quality, so Yay being shady is her redeemable quality, okay? <laughs> That's her redeemable quality, and you guys are going to take him off the layout, and it's fine. You can do that. It's okay. I'm not going to be sad about it or anything, but I'm going to be blue. I'm going to be really sad when I have to get the old, new layout again. It's, it's, that's going to be really sad. Wow, what a totem. We love finding a totem that is plus one everything, but it does not matter because it's a one-shot. 
One HP? What is that even supposed to mean? What? On <laughs> first. <laughs> oh my god. A totem Shininja to begin. Because of course, right? That's like the best Pokemon to begin with. What do you mean? What are you even talking about? That's like so mean that you don't think that way. You don't think the same way as I do. Therefore, you're wrong. <laughs> Oh, I forgot to buy repels. Yep, I was that dumbass. <sighs> I do it every time because Sun and Moon is actually really good about like spacing out their grass to where it's easy to kind of go and avoid it and not worry about it. So it's not a hindrance, which is like such a big plus that this game has over other games. But I always forget about this section because the rest of the game is so good. Ugh. Sun and Moon is one of my favorite Pokemon games. It it really is. Like, yes, story-wise, uh, it's 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 rough. That's why we're playing the better story version. And that's why we now literally cannot play any other version as long as we beat this game because checkpoint seven, then it'll go to eight because it's the Switch games and um, th that being said, um, the reason why is because I don't know how to do the things that I'm doing in the other games. Um, so I don't want to, like, I'd rather kind of learn and pick that up. <sighs> but yeah, so I oopsied. <laughs> Maybe we have an escape route to save all of my problems, because I probably didn't even remember that either. Nope, I did not. Nope. Oh, I just saw makeup bag. It was it. it a rather chick-looking case that carries lipsticks. Can we? No. Okay. We can't do anything with it. Okay. Wait. What is in here? Oh yeah, it's our it's our normality MZ. I was like, what is in here that? Yeah, dang it, I'm mad about forgetting that, but we're gonna get a a Scolipede as an encounter. Well, it's a Whirlipede, but it will be a Scolipede by the time we need it, so. Well, actually, that's a lie, because this is up to, like, 237 or something like that. So we might actually... Oh, I was just say if that actually caught immediately, I would just be like, what? Oh, wait. What does that do? We became the center of attention. Doesn't, isn't that like more of a double battles move? It's like opposite follow, or no, triple battles move because it's opposite follow me. Because there's no reason to use spotlight. Unless spotlight um, makes you or uh, your ally also hit you if you're faster. Because if that's the case, then ooh boy. Spotlight would actually be annoying, but I don't think it works that way. I think it literally will just change your target. And it's like, well, if this is my target to begin with anyway, what's the point? Wait, it can catch any po- oh, it-, it it's making it sound like it's a Master Ball. I always forget if it is or not, like, if it works in that way. We'll try it on a tougher Pokemon. Because if it is, great. I always forget if it works that way, though. Give Whirlipede a nickname. We're gonna nickname you... Ari. Ari the Whirlipede, you are going to have what ability? You have Stench. You're not holding anything. Spotlight. Use your shine to spotlight on the target so that the so that only the target will be attacked during the turn. Only the target, does that mean what does that mean? 
got a good bug. The first impression on a Sculipede is actually super scary. Does that mean literally everybody? Because that's super good on a Sculipede. Like, if you know that your opponent's weak to fire, you don't have any fire to hit it with. Boom. Oh. Chorus card, I joked about this Pokemon. And that would have been amazing for us to do. That would have been one of my favorite Pokemon, just right then and there, but no. Oh my god. This area. Maybe we can get a shiny and make it all worth it. Oh, that's another one of my favorites. I mean, this this area is honestly probably where I'll train, because if you have Toucanon and Togekiss and Scolipede, that's like, that's three bangers right there. Three bangers that I'm okay with getting a shiny out of. And I have a lucky egg, so it doesn't necessarily matter as much. And Toucanon has Misty Surge as an ability, which is such a good ability, like preventing status conditions. Yes, please. What else do we got here? Tezza. Tezza's fine too. Honestly, I'll take a shiny Tezza. That's that's but all of this is okay. Hitmonlee, that's probably the worst one we found so far, as far as like Pokemon that I care about and not care about. But I mean, when you can say that, that tells you this is an area that I'm okay with shiny hunting in. That is what we've learned, is shiny hunting in areas like this is perfectly fine. Gudra? Joy Drop? That's fine too. I'll take a Joy Drop. Shiny Joy Drop? Yeah, dude, please. And you get encounters every five seconds anyway, so it's a positive thing. That makes that an easy thing, because then you can just train a lot easier in here. Oh look, this one also has a surge move too, guys. <clears throat> Even better. Oh well, I mean, I guess technically it's gonna evolve, so it'll lose it, but... Congratulations, you beat my trial. That took us 10 minutes to get out of, that's... <laughs> that's why I hate that area. That is exactly why I cannot stand that area. Snap, so, you can make it through here now. Good job. Well, I believe that we can get encounters now. What is Cosmo? Oh, yeah, we, we, we knew that already. Ah. Uh, I feel like Joy will understand why I reacted. Joy will understand very well why I reacted, or why I reacted like that just then. I feel stupid now, but it's okay. <laughs> I thought I got this. It's fine. Uh, we can do X, Y, and Z now. No, no, we can't. But. You know, at least now I know why I thought that. Um, I better hope that's not a 6v6 fight. Why the f- This always happens, okay? When- Can you explain this? Why does this always fucking happen? When we freaking complain about something. We literally complain. And then it happens. I don't get it. I really don't get it. Like, I'm still blaming it on the Jonas curse. I don't care. It technically it's something that he's involved with. So therefore, I'm blaming it on him. But I was being I was being and seeing about myself because I <laughs> I can't go too far. What the fuck? <laughs> well, I'm spoiling the 
episode is, um, <laughs> yo, we might have to have a new spotlight of today's episode. Oh my god, what the fudge? Why? What is, what is with this? Okay, Diamond Storm, because you're resistant to that. Karate Chop. Oh my god. Why? Why do you actually have the move, too? <laughs> uh, I cannot believe that it actually has Karate Chop, too. That's crazy. I almost want to use my my Dream Ball Master Ball situation, but that nope, can't do that. We can heal him right up. Well, that's great. That's a, actually how I'm gonna end today's episode off. I don't. I'm not even gonna worry about this potential six v six battle. I'll go in and see. But this is a perfect way to end off the boat with the boys. Okay. And Travis Kelsey is learning Shadow Sneak. Huh, I wonder why. Um, you're not actually going to learn it, though, because Shadow Ball is better. But the fact that you even attempted, I wonder why. Oh, Beakers wants to learn Extreme Speed. No. Oh, my God. I love you all so very much for watching today's crazy shenanigans of an episode. Everybody will be off the layout except for Shady Penguin because that's the only way that I'll actually appreciate Yay today. Um, we're we're gonna name this, of course. We we have to name it this. you have iron fist and a relic face so we can fist like a champion and have his old relic of ancient times just displaying the fact that he knows what he's doing 